Good morning, you guys. <laughs> We're just getting ready to take Paul and Alex to the train station. They are going to London. They're going to the National History Museum. Pack them a packed lunch. Water for Paul, water for Alex. Let me, mommy, close that. Thank you. And then in here, there's masks, um, gel, you know, sanitizing gel and tissues. And then in here, there's like rubbish bag, there's wipes and some sweet treats and chewing gum for the journey. And then in the back, here there's a bag with crisps a bag with um snacks like cakes and biscuits and then right at the bottom there there's a lunch box with a sandwich each and a load of these ritz crackers as well and then as well there's two big bags there plastic bags that could be used as um a seat you know if they need to sit somewhere to eat before going into the uh, sorry the museum or you know because it's been raining or it's going to rain today and if they don't need it then it just it's just two bags it doesn't take up much room and um ozzy and i are going to take them to the to the train station I've decided to get a stew on the slow cooker going when Paul and Alex get back tonight. It'd be lovely to have something nice, warm, homemade. So I've done this a million times on my channel, so I'm not going to show you, but I've got the meat here and I've cleared out the fridge. All the vegetables that needed to go are going in there. So I grated a courgette, little bits of corn, carrot, mushrooms and once I've put this in I'll do the potatoes as well all ready I'm just waiting for it to boil and then I'll put it in there and I'm gonna put it on high for maybe two hours or so and then low and just leave it until tonight just waiting for it to boil so that gives it a little bit of a head start yeah, show you my new cake stand. Isn't it gorgeous? Now, if you don't recognize it, these are my old plates. Now, they have been in our garage waiting to go to the tip for months. And then I saw a hack about turning it into a cake stand. This is one of the balls that belongs to this set. Um, and the great thing about these balls, let me show you, right? So these are the ones we currently use. They would work well as well, actually, but they have a really big base. So they provide a super stable thing there. And obviously the plate, because it has this slip, I really like it. I actually managed to um, sort of salvage another one because basically all my others I've got like, they've got cracks and lots of scratches, but there's one more plate, I think, and then one more bowl that I'm gonna use. And I'll probably, I'm gonna make one and give it to a friend or something like that. I thought that was, that looked really good. It looks like a real thing. So yeah, this is the stay of the kitchen, the kitchen but I don't care right now gonna make a coffee and chill out for a minute with Ozzy. Okay you guys, so done. Someone's woken up, he's having a rice cake and doing his favorite thing, which is looking at the washing machine and the dryer. <laughs> It was quite fun. Was it really busy? Yes, but it is London. It is. That's right. So London. And, <laughs> and my 
least favourite bit was um well, not really in London, it was more of waiting for the bus to get back. It was, it did take a long time, wasn't and, it? And but one of my favourite bits was seeing the guards. The guards, that's right. You saw them they were doing a little parade. Paul, can I have that footage? Yeah, I'll send it to you. Yeah, I'll put that in the video as well for everyone to see. And what about the National History Museum? Was that good? Um, well, I liked it, um, but it got really, really hot and so crowded and then I just... I just wanted I just, to go, didn't yeah. you? Okay. Didn't even buy anything. Yeah, that's right. Thank you. Doing as your bubs. <laughs> Pajamas on the floor. So I've spent most of the morning putting together a meal plan for the next upcoming week, starting tomorrow, um, Thursday, and then Friday. So this is the lunches. So this is what I've got, and then this is the dinners okay and then i let me move that because there's little hands coming over hey eh? hey gorgeous <laughs> and then what i did is i got did the shopping list by sort of section like frozen stuff fruit and veg so it's easy because it's quite a big shopping list. Dairy, eating fish, fridge stuff, and cupboard stuff. So I'm going to Aldi today. I have not been to Aldi in ages. So I'm going to go to Aldi and I'm going to film that haul for you and how much I spent and all that jazz. But yeah, I think I'm going to finish this video here. It's a bit of a short one i'm still in my pajamas so i'm not gonna show you what i look like we're gonna have a coffee now before i go and get ready but that's it i'll see you guys in the next one bye <laughs>